everybody. How are you? Anybody here? Andy, stop. <laughs> we are here to show the Bring Back My Bars. I just got them today. Hello, Ethan. I see you. I have my nephew, Jeremy, here, all the way up from Mississippi. Hello. Now this one's broken. No, Andy, stop. And we are going to go one by one. I'll give you the description of what they are. And we're going to sniff test them and give you our opinions. All right, what's, what's this? All right, if I can keep my children from distracting me. I don't know what that error was, but hopefully everybody can see me. Can you see us on there? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. You let me know. I got him working the phone here, so it'll let me know if anybody joins us this time. Because last time, Facebook didn't let me know if you joined us. All right. So our first one. Pick one, Jeremy. Which one do you want to try first? Cucumber <laughs> lime. Now, these are going on sale at 1, one o'clock our time. Eastern Standard Time on my website. So you'll be able to start buying these January 1st. So this is cucumber lime. And I've never smelled any of these. These are all new to me. All new. I smell cucumber. And mm -hmm. I smell the lime. I can smell it from over here. Yeah, it's it's... It's strong. I like it. Yeah, what we're doing is the oils. If you see a sniff in the bottoms, the oils. Um, what is that called, Jeremy? What? They settle in yeah. the bottom. So it's a little stronger in the bottom. That smells really good. I might have to add that to my Scentsy Club. It says uh, two people were in here, but I can't okay. see. <clears throat> I like that one a lot. Yeah, that's a good one. Reminds me of spring. Yeah. Yep. Mm -hmm. I think I'm going to put that in my Scentsy Club. So I'm going to put that. So cucumber <laughs> lime, it says, cool, refreshing blend of mellow cucumber and tangy lime. Mm. All right. Fancy. That smells good. Let's do, I have been waiting for this one. Perk me up. Let's see, perk me up. Simply the most perfect cup of coffee you'll ever experience. A strong brew of Guatemalan coffee beans and just a touch of hazelnut. All right. Ooh. Oh, that smells good. <laughs> that smells like... I, I smell chocolate, but it doesn't say chocolate in there. Oh, yeah, that definitely smells like coffee on the bottom. But it, it smells like you got some chocolate mixed in. Maybe like a creamer or something. Yeah, it definitely, uh, in my opinion, smells... Like a coffee creamer. Yeah. Like some of those you can buy. Oh yeah, at the store. That, that smells good. It's very wow. strong. It's a good scent. I think I'm gonna put that in my Scentsy Club too. <laughs> Andy, you're gonna keep my Scentsy Club stack over there. No. I'm gonna, I'm gonna <laughs> take out for myself. All right. Next one is coconut palm. Coconut palm. This one says a blend of tropical coconut and musky choli with subtle green notes and I love anything coconut I just don't like eating coconut I like the smell I don't like eating it I smell coconut I mean I like patchouli I'm not getting it. I smell like I'm down in like 
Florida drink, drinking a pina colada. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it definitely sounds like a pina colada. Yeah. It reminds me of a tropical climate. And I will yeah. say, just, we've done three of them so far. And, uh, without even being warm, I can sit, I can smell them from over here yeah. without even, you know, doing this. Oh, yeah. So. They're very strong. Very strong, good sense. Yep. You know, this this reminds me of summer. Yeah. Um, which is my favorite time. So. That I might have to bring my warmer to Florida when we go in June. So I'm going <laughs> to take this. I'm going to burn it or warm it in our condo. Andy, put that in my Sensi Club stack. All right, next. We're all going in the Sensi Club. <laughs> Sensi Club. You it's perfect it. because if they would ever take these away, if it's in your club, they will still make it for you. For you. No. It's fine. My child likes to aggravate sometimes. Okay, this is Apple Press. Apple Press. This is the smell of crisp fall days. Crunchy apples. Ooh, I smell the apples already. Juicy pears and just a hint of the last full roses of the summer. Yeah, I smell apple. I'm not smelling the rose. Let me see. Okay. It's a little stronger on the bottom. But I definitely smell apple. Maybe a little bit of pear. That smells good. I don't think I'd put it in my Scentsy Club. I could smell a pear. Really? Yeah. Hmm, maybe my nose is not working. I'm a big fan of the pear smell, so I can smell that instantly. Okay. But the apple is strong. It reminds yeah. me of a, uh, you know, like a... A fall day, like a fall scent? Yeah. Yeah. yeah it's, it's definitely a fall scent. Yeah. You know, fall scents are my favorite, so... Yeah. If I, you know, had to pick, this would be my favorite so far. Apple Press. Thank you, Tanya. I see you commented. Thank you. I still don't understand this Facebook Live thing. It doesn't want to tell me. Yeah, I don't see anything on my I, end. So. I, I got a notification that she commented, so thank you, Tanya. Andy, put this no, I see not it. in my Scentsy Club, but off to the side. Okay, this one, I have been, ever since I saw the name of this, I've been wanting to know what in the world this smells like. Which one's this? Quiver. Oh, yeah, this one's one of my favorites from the description. This is Quiver. This is innocent vanilla flower, warm sandalwood, and sultry night blooming tuberose in a seductive scent meant to cause a shiver of delight. I can't wait to smell this one. It's very floral. Mm -hmm. Very floral. If you like floral stuff, you would love this. Yeah, it's very, it's very rosy. The description uh, explains itself. It smells good. It's not what I thought it would be, but it smells good. So that's quiver. You can definitely smell the flowers. It's floral. Yeah, I would say this is something that smells like if you were giving somebody flowers, like on a Valentine's Day yeah. deal or any any type of flowers, this is what that would smell like. Okay. This one's interesting. I'm a big fan. And you might have to put that one in your Scentsy Club, too. I don't know if I would warm that or not. I mean... I'm not a floral person. I love bakery. Anything cinnamon, cinnamon coconut... And um, spicy stuff, and lemons, oh. you know, berries, stuff like that. But I don't know if I would burn. I, I keep wanting to say burn. Warm that. I don't know. It's good. I, would I might have it. to try it. I'd warm it. I'll try it. <laughs> Next one. Andy picked this one out. <laughs> Flirtatious. Oh, yeah. Flirtatious. This is... Fruit, ooh, fruity and vibrant. I love fruity. A combination of green apple, grapefruit, and white amber. Andy, you might like that. You love green apple. Oh, yeah. 
paper is in the room. Smells good. This will be going in my sense of cold. <laughs> I love anything berries. <sighs> berries, not flowers, Andy. That smells wonderful. <clears throat> That's flirtatious. I feel like I've smelled this before somewhere. Mm -hmm. It's it's kind of like a uh, oh something you would get on Valentine's Day. Yeah, but it's like almost like a you know candy smell too. Yeah, or like I just a real place it. candy smell to it. You know, yeah, the green apple you can definitely smell. Yeah, grapefruit. that smells good. Yum. Plus, it's pink too. That's exciting. Yes, that would be great for Valentine's Day. Yes. Especially when it's called flirtatious. I mean, yeah, definitely. Kind of all goes together. I'd... <laughs> hey, if you order my February box, you'll get information later in January for February. Just like my January box. You might even get this. That would be a good Valentine's box. Yeah. But I don't want to tell you what's in my boxes because I want you to be surprised. So, but that, set, put that in my Scentsy Club, Andy. <laughs> Okay, Woodland Suede. I've heard about this one. I thought it was Suede. 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 All right, Peanut Factory. <laughs> Retreat to a tranquil wooded wonderland, redolent with red oak, smoky cedar, suede musk, and bright winter lemon. That's a good combination. Anybody commenting? Hi, Tanya. Merry Christmas. I hope you guys had a good Christmas. I saw your pictures. They look good. Hmm. That smells like a man smell. Let me guess. Outdoors? Definitely. Mm-hmm. Matches my jacket. Yeah. It smells good. It smells like a forest. Oh, here. Woodland suede. It smells like a forest. So remember, all these go on sale starting January 1st on my site. Oh, yeah, it's strong. It's It's got definitely got that musk smell. I don't really smell the lemon, though. Do you? This feels like a, uh, or smells like a nice day out in the Mississippi woods. Okay. I'm a Miss, Mississippi man here. Where I live. And, okay. Uh, this is something I would put in my car, personally. Okay. Think your if dad would like it? No, he's not very outdoorsy. <laughs> okay. But uh, I am, and 100% uh, would put that like in my vehicle or, or something like okay. that. Okay. want to buy it right now? Yeah. <laughs> not Scentsy Club worthy. Oh. I like it, but it's too musky for me. He oh. likes it. It's going in there you go. Now this one I've heard about, Pima Cotton, and I heard it's very laundry smelling, Pima Cotton. This is a light, clean blend of lilies, is it Frasia, and Jasmine. Frasia, Frasia. <laughs> oh, definitely, that's floral. Ooh, that's strong. I like strong ones. Ooh, you'll like that one. <laughs> but it, it smells okay. I mean, I'm not a big floral person, but that this This smells, smells good. like a... Uh, this smells like a fresh set of sheets, like at a hotel or something. Yes, you know? something freshly very, laundered sheets. Very fresh and very light and delicate. Mm-hmm. It's a delicate smell, but it's yeah. strong, but it, it reminds yeah. me of like a... Uh, oh, we have a peanut <laughs> going to be joining us. It reminds us. me of just something like that. Something like very mm -hmm. clean and yeah. fresh and light. Crisp and light, just... Light, like a light smell, yeah. but it's strong, but okay. I like it. Okay. Put that in your sensey clothes. No, I don't think I would burn... I, I don't think I would warm that. Where did he go? He ran off. I don't think I would put my sensey clothes... I would. I, I would. Hmm. This one was another interesting one. Peen peanut. Oh. Don't be don't be doing that. 
You're screwing up my video, Andy. Peanut, Where'd everybody go? Has to be a oh, there's my there's my comments. See, Peanut did something good. <laughs> All right, so oh, Ethan, you wanna say hi? <laughs> Mediterranean Spa. Now this one with the bring back my bars. What they did last summer, I wasn't involved because I I hadn't joined since yet, but. Everyone voted for their favorite scents to come back. These were all retired. And they voted 20 back. And then five were voted back from the CEO. And I know this one was uh, voted back from the CEO. He picked this one. Mediterranean Spa. Uh, Mediterranean Spa. Relax with this smooth, fresh, and breezy scent. Mm. It's going to... Maybe like I'm on a cruise ship. That is not what I thought it would smell like. What do you mean? I was thinking more of like a ocean breeze kind of thing. Ooh, now that's a different scent on the bottom. That's stronger. Now that smells good. That smells something like like a spa, something they would be burning or candles or whatever in a spa. Okay. Something relaxing. Let's see here. That's a good one. I like that one. It smells like relaxation, like you could it turn the a, lights uh, off, put your warmer on, put that on, listen to some music or read a book. It would it would be like the smell that you imagine sitting in a hot tub slash spa. Yeah. And this would be the smell that would be basically in the room from yeah. all the soap and different things. Yeah. That's what that's that what this good. smells like. That I think might go in my sensi club, Andy. Yeah, definitely. That's that's yeah, it. You've got quite the pile over here. I know. My this, sensi club is going to grow you got quiver, like crazy. This is, a, this is a really good one. Yeah, I like that one. So put this one in my sensi club, Andy. Yeah, he likes this one. So. Don't put that in my sensi club. You can put it in his sensi club. Yeah, here, here you can. Yes, I'm. I'm turning my nephew. He was here last night, and he went through my personal stash, and he found somebody really liked. That's right. So I am a big Scentsy fan. Yes, um, he is. I'm a big fan of scents and you know stuff that smells good. So yep, I'm I'm fully on board with the the Scentsy products because they're high quality and they smell really good. Yeah. So yeah, you were telling me about we won't mention the name of the store, but the ones that you bought. Yeah, the store down bought there ones. You know, is they just, just they don't last as long. They're no. they're smaller and you know, yeah, they just they don't yeah. They don't scent your house up very well. Exactly. Like right now, I have maraschino sugar cookie going, and that is just the bomb. That is my favorite, I absolute can, favorite. I can smell it sitting here. Mm -hmm. and I've been here a couple hours tonight. Yeah. And, you know, most of the store-bought ones, you, you put them on, you know, it smells for a little while. And yeah. It just kind of goes away. Mm -hmm. Whereas that, it's like a constant smell. Yeah. So. I love it. It smells like yummy cookies in here. I love it. Okay. Rum ra speaking of cookies. Rum raisin cookie. Ooh, rum. rum raisin cookie. This one is freshly baked cookie dough sumptuously spiced with rum, raisin, and clove will transport you to the corner bakery. I will probably love this because I love bakery. Hmm. Get ready, Andy. It's going to smell like a baker. It's sweet. It smells like cookies. It smells like a pumped up sugar cookie. Now I smell the rum on the bottom. You can smell like butter mm -hmm. yumminess. Oh. That might have to go to on my <laughs> I can smell it as soon as you gave it to me. <laughs> that is yeah. yummy. Smelling. 
It's definitely a, uh, another strong scent. Yeah. Um, I can definitely smell the oatmeal, oatmeal raisin. Yeah. Cookie. Yeah. I can smell that a lot. Mm-hmm. And those, I think, have a great smell naturally. Oh, yeah. So those are one of my favorite. If you like those, this would be perfect. Yeah. You can, you can warm these in your house before people come over, and they'll think you've been baking all day. My favorite thing, personally, about these Scentsy products is, for instance, it's called Rum Raisin Cookie. Mm-hmm. You know, it's very accurate to what Oh yeah. this is describing. For instance, not only what it says on the paper, but what it's called. I mean, it's very accurate. You know? Yeah. That's what I think Scentsy does a good job with, is yeah. the fact that it's straight to the point. You're mm-hmm. not... You're not getting one thing that's being sold as, and it's totally different. You're yeah. getting exactly what it says it is. Yep. So I like that. Yep. That's the rum. Oh at? yeah. Put that in my Sensi club. Where's the rum at? The rum's. In there. It's in that bar. Okay. <laughs> yeah, this ain't rum. This just smells like rum. Vanilla cream. That's probably going to be another one of my favorites. And I love their details that they come up with. Every one of these has a different detail. That is true. On. I noticed that. Each one of yeah. these, these uh, is that know, packages, they all have their own. It looks like it has vanilla flowers on the package. Yeah, basically what it is is they try to, they put different things on there to match what, mm-hmm. what is, oh yeah. is, what the sin is. So vanilla cream, French vanilla mm, with a touch of coconut milk. Oh boy. You ever had coconut milk? No. Yeah. Really? <laughs> like I said, I ate coconut anything like cookies or candy or anything, but the scent, oh, I love scent. It smells milk. good. It's one of those things that smells good that you would think would taste good, but I don't know. It kind of... It does smell it milky. smells a lot better. I do smell the vanilla. Not much coconut. Now that's a little more coconutty on the bottom. I don't know if I put that in my Scentsy Club, but it's good. I like it. It's definitely a uh, softer scent. Yeah, it's not as strong. Yeah, it's definitely one of those uh, those scents that you kind of just have going. That's not as you know, like you said, not as yeah. strong. Yeah. But it's definitely. Yeah. You can definitely smell it. Yeah. <laughs> I like it. My oldest is sitting here playing Pokemon Go while we're doing our video. Can you turn the volume down, please? I don't want to hear them. So put this in my maybe column. It's in my always. <laughs> Autumn <laughs> Stroll. Autumn Stroll. Let's see. Amble under a bright harvest moon. Leaves crunching underfoot as peppery cinnamon mingles. Oh, I love cinnamon with dusky plum and warm wood incense to create a spicy and comforting fragrance. I bet you I'm gonna like this. Anything that has Ooh. autumn or anything to do with fall is my favorite. I smell leaves, definitely leaves. It smells like you're out raking leaves. Yeah, definitely. I don't know about cinnamon. Maybe it does have a little spice to it. A little kick. Yeah, but I definitely smell leaves. Like you're out raking them. Like yeah, that smell. It definitely. It feels like a nice fall morning when you wake up you look outside and it's mm-hmm. kind of foggy there's dew on the ground yeah you know yeah. right around that November time you yep. know October November I can definitely smell the leaves there too mm-hmm. yeah that one I don't put that in my sensi club <laughs> yeah are you put yeah don't put it in mine put it in his I put the, I put the, the, the three on in there okay thank you Anna. all right this one, I love yellows. Uh, I Autumn you're Blaze Maple. You're going to give him quiver? Yeah, I might need that. <laughs> Autumn Blaze Maple. A bountiful harvest of crisp 
apples. A bountiful harvest of crisp apples and earthy pumpkins with golden maple syrup. Oh boy. Warm cinnamon and a ribbon of smoldering oak. That's a lot of stuff in there. Ooh, that's strong. A little too much. Nah. I definitely smell the maple. I can smell it from here. That that maple, <laughs> if you love maple syrup, oh yeah, this is... <laughs> Are we trouble? <laughs> it doesn't want to come out. All right. You're coming out. There we go. Oh yeah, definitely maple. That's a strong maple. Maybe a little bit of cinnamon. I don't know about the oak. The pumpkins, maybe? A little bit? I rinsed my nose here. In my opinion, it's another false scent. Yeah. Um, you know, it, I can smell the pumpkin, mm -hmm. and it kind of has, like, you know, it's made mostly yellow, like the packaging is yellow, yeah. but it has that yeah. orange, orange tint. Yeah, tint. I can smell the pumpkins in it more uh -huh. than I can okay. the syrup, maybe. The I smell a lot of the syrup more than anything. But, uh, that smells good, and that's like going in my sensei club. I like this in my sensei club, too, but put, my, put it in mine first. Yeah, put it in his first. <laughs> Fried ice cream. Oh, wow. This is a sometimes. Fried ice cream. Andy, put it back in the container. That's okay. Put it in there. <laughs> Vanilla with nutty touch, along with oh, cinnamon again. Cinnamon and caramel. It doesn't smell like ice cream. Not what I thought it would be. What? Andy! <laughs> I'm going to ban you to your room. There's another one. I have to get out. Push it out. Oh, there we go. I smell the caramel on the bottom. It's more caramely. I don't know if I would do. You know that's my club. like that little crumbly stuff that's on top of an apple pie or something mm -hmm. like that. Yeah, that's what that smells okay. like, in my opinion. Okay. So if you like apple pie, yeah, you know, I like it. This, it's good. This is very similar to that. I don't know if I would do Sensi Club though. It is good, but I like it. It's not what I thought it would be. But if you want to put it in your stack. We'll put it in Andy's Sensi Club. Okay. <laughs> All right. Next one. Oh, you want me to do this one? Oh, peppermint rush. We were just talking about peppermint stuff last night. Yeah. So. Oh, I can even just now smell it. I didn't even open yeah, it. I can yet. smell it without it being open. Uh-huh. Just open. Oh. But still, like it's closed. You can so smell peppermint it. rush. Peppermint, sweet vanilla, and a cord of freshly fallen snow. Oh, there we go. Now the peppermint's coming through. Mm. Oh, it's very peppermint on, peppermint on the bottom. Oh, yum. That's good. That is a good one. I love perfect peppermint. Perfect peppermint's a little stronger peppermint. But this one's a little more because it's got mixed stuff in it. It that reminds me of like a, if you make peppermint. a peppermint bark, yeah. something that's made like that, you know, that's what this Maybe smells like. Maybe like with a white chocolate mixed yeah, in or something. something like that, yeah. It's, it's, yeah. It's, it's a strong peppermint scent, but it's not like strong, strong. It's mm -hmm. kind of mixed between all the other things. Yeah, but it smells good. That's yeah. a maybe, Andy. That's a maybe. <laughs> I can't get this one out. Leave it go and I'll get it. Cranberry muffin. 
I like that. Mm, one. That sounds good. Bursting with bright cranberries, enveloped in a buttery brown sugar batter, with nuances of walnuts and toffee. Toffee's always good. And that, when I open it up, it's yellow. That's. I, I thought like I was it. thinking it'd be like a red. Now this smells like a perfume. I've smelled this before. Does that smell like grandma's perfume? Something that she wore? I've smelled that before. Somewhere. A part of it is. I can smell that. Yeah. I that mean. We're talking about my mom and his grandma. She wore a perfume. And it smells you know just that, like You know that little, that little uh, round thing mm -hmm. that she always had? Yeah. The powder or something? No. I know she had a powder. There was too. like this little thing, you know, it was liquid. And she mm -hmm. sprayed it. And... Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's I very like that. Strong. That This reminds me of my mom. Yeah. When, as soon as I smelled that, that's. Oh, wow. Now I'm going to cry. <laughs> I definitely think it smells like that. Wow. Now, on the bottom, you can smell the muffin. It's strong muffins. Smelling, yeah, yeah. It's more like it's like a buttery scent. Yeah. So I think when this mixes, yeah. But yeah, yeah, that's definitely grammar. Definitely. Something similar to that. Scentsy Club. You like that one? Oh, I, I forget exactly what it was she had, but. I, I have a bottle it. of it somewhere. Yeah, it's a bottle of something. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Green tea smoothie. I'm not a tea person. Let's see what it says. Green tea smoothie. Energizing green tea and fresh ginger with peach. Oh, I love peach. Nectarine and cranberry. Mmm. I can smell the ginger in this. Definitely. I can smell ginger. Now I smell the peach and the nectarine. I don't smell the cranberry as much. It smells good. It's, like I said, the bottom is stronger. Ooh, that one's good. That one's good. That smells good. Green tea smoothie. It smells just like green tea. If you like green tea. Mm. Yeah, I'm not a big tea drinker. Anybody coming in there? Anybody commenting, Jeremy? I'm not paying Did attention. I, am I missing? <laughs> I hope I'm not missing anybody. But hello, everybody, if you're in here. And if there's any questions and I miss them, I'll come back and answer them for you. Oh, yeah. that's, that's One at a time. Oh, okay. <laughs> Hazelnut latte. I've been wanting to smell this one. Hazelnut latte. Frothy steamed milk, toasted hazelnuts, espresso, and vanilla with a dusting of cinnamon. It's espresso, not espresso. Espresso. You said espresso. Whatever. All right, stop. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, this is definitely going in the club. Can I just keep this one? No. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, I didn't tell you. My Nova warmer that I had in my last video, my oldest Andy, he wants to steal it from me. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to have to get me another I'm one. I'm going to take it from you. I'm and put it in his room. And I'm going to use this. Because it's so beautiful. Camera. I love that. And, uh... I liked it so much that I'll be getting me one of those as well. Yeah. It is beautiful. On it. Okay. I like that one. If you're a coffee fan, you'll definitely like it. I don't drink coffee. I don't like coffee. My husband, Scott, he makes it every morning. He works downstairs. And I like the smell of it. It uh that that is wonderful. This reminds me of like making grandma's coffee with all that creamer in it. Mm -hmm. This is like a coffee with heavy creamer in it. Yeah, that smells. That's what this good. smells like. That's that hazelnut latte. Yeah, it's it's a heavy cream coffee. Definite Scentsy Club, Andy. I told you. It was good. 
<laughs> flower shop. Now, I don't know about this one. Like I said, I'm not a floral person. It's, it, it's, flower shop. It's very good. You like this one? Yeah. Andy loves smelling these too. We are a scentsy family. Just like walking into a flower shop. Hmm. Fair enough. Definitely. Not much of a description needed for that one. Yeah, it? that's definite. It smells like the flower section at Kmart when they still had it. <laughs> oh, yeah. That smells good. Like that worm. I don't know if I would get it all the time, but it smells good. It's not, it doesn't turn me away, but I know you like florals. The bottom, it's, the bottom yeah. of it is it's very floral. If you put your nose into a rose, that's what it would smell like. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. 100%. That's not my club. Maybe Jeremy's can I, club? Can I just have this one? Well, it depends. If any of you want a little snippet of these, I can send you a free sample. Just I could just cut you a little sliver of it and mail it to you if you want to try out any of these. Um, crumb top. Crumb oh, top. Crumb top, yeah. The perfect blend of oats, butter, and brown sugar to top your favorite dessert. Mmm. Mm. <laughs> this might be another Sissy Club. Oh. Yum. It's very nutty smelling. Oh, that's wonderful. That, yeah. Wonderful? Wonderful. That is good. Crumb top. Oats, butter, brown sugar on top of your favorite dessert. It reminds me of a uh, nutter butter. Hmm. Okay. That's, that smells good. It almost makes you want to eat it. Yeah, <laughs> I know. And he's already trying to eat that one, whatever yes. that one is. <laughs> apple brown I have strange children, Ooh. just to let you know. But I will say again for what I mentioned earlier about how accurate it is for what, what is being put on the packaging for what it yeah, is. Yeah, and the descriptions. Is there a max it's very definitely it's very spot on. Is there a limit to how many you can put? Nope. You can put as much in your Sensi Club as you want. Sensi Club is wonderful. Let me oh. pause real quick. Because like I said, years ago, and Andy will verify this, we loved Berry Bright. Loved it. I bought a few of them, waited, went back, it was gone. I couldn't get it anymore. They don't sell it anymore. Mm. If that would have been in my club, and even though they retired it, they will make it for you as long as you keep it in your Scentsy Club cart. Never goes away. It'll it never go away. Club. It's only the wax, none of the room sprays or anything. They just do it for the wax. But, I mean, if I would have known that, I don't think Scentsy Club was around when Berry Bright was out, but that is our absolute favorite. Well, why, why don't you? It smells uh, like a blue slushy, mm, and it's wonderful. It's one. burning. It's warming in the Nova right now. Is it? Mm -hmm. Why don't you put it on the Sensi Club right now? I can't because it, it's it's gone. Well, make them put it on. There. So as long as it's on their site and it's addable into your Sensi Club, and you keep it in there, they'll make it forever for you. And you, if you have $30 of Scentsy items in there in your club, that's when you start getting 10% off your order of your Scentsy club. If you go up to $60, then you earn a half price item of anything, any consumable item. You could do a laundry liquid, you can do a dish soap, you can do a fragrance flower or whatever, and you would get it half off, plus the 10% discount. So that's why I love Scentsy Club. Spiced berries. That smells. That sounds good. Spiced I know berries. I like this one. I like berry stuff. It's, it looks. Like, it's like a little uh, picture. It's got like a little limb of berries in mm -hmm. the picture. I don't know if you can see that. It's so cute. I love it. And all these are made in Idaho. We always like USA. USA. These are made in Idaho. Um, spiced berries is Franken, frankincense and myrrh waft 
beneath decadent berries to create a timeless scent. Mm -hmm. Definitely berries. If you, if it smells like, like a cranberry. If you just like have a scentsy club and there's no limit, why don't you just like put them all in there so they can make them all forever? I could. And you should. I know I have maraschino sugar cookie in my scentsy club. That will never go. And vanilla bean buttercream. Because these all smell good. Oh, that smells like a cake. That smells good. I like that. That's another fall scent. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. You can smell the spice. It's like a, uh, this would be perfect around Thanksgiving. Mm -hmm. It's like a transition from fall to winter. Yeah. Reminds me of like cranberry sauce or something mm -hmm. like that. Or, yeah. You know, the cinnamons and different things. The nutmeg and. This reminds yeah. me of Thanksgiving, personally. Yeah. The That's transition from Thanksgiving to winter. It has kind of a, you know, winter scent to it, but mm -hmm. the cranberry is strong and I like that. Yeah. That's another, since Andy has left us. <laughs> so just lay that there and I'll put it in my club. Melon, I've been wanting to smell this one. Melon and apple granita. I love anything melon. I love melons. We were huge on melons when I was growing up. All right, where are you? Melon. There you are. Crisp apple and sweet melon surge with sparkling citrus. And I love citrus. Oh. Yeah, citrus is my, one of my favorites. I definitely smell the melon. It smells like a sugar melon. I can smell it. Can look. Yeah. Oh, yes. That, that is definitely like a, like a summer smell. Yeah, that's my smell. That is a fruity smell. I love that. Or yeah, that's you that's can like definitely. A, it smells like a, like a cantaloupe. It smells like that special line of Starbursts that they have. Mm -hmm. They're like I don't remember what they are, but it smells like a specific Starburst. The pink one? Yeah, not the pink ones, not the originals. It's like uh, the red. No, it's no. it's like a it's a continuation of them. Yeah. But it smells just but like that. Smell, that smells good. Like Definite that. Scentsy Club. Watermelon? No, it's not watermelon. It's like no. a. I smell yeah. cantaloupe. Yeah, big Definitely time cantaloupe. Cantaloupe, mm -hmm. like cantaloupe Possibly, who knows? I, I don't know. I like that Scentsy Club, along with that spice berry. Yeah, that's my snack. I'm gonna eat You're it not gonna eat it. Yeah, it is. It's my <laughs> anything fruity, personally, anything fruity and citrusy, oh, and you know, and I like all that stuff. Mm -hmm. And that's another thing. When we retire, well, me and the hubs are going to be going to Florida. I'm tired of the cold weather, and I want to smell the ocean air. I just love yes. the tropical smells. All the ocean ones are good too. <sighs> mm. Pear blossom and cucumber. I love cucumber you too. This kind of a house. <laughs> You're gonna buy us a house, right? No. If you're retiring, you get you got money. <laughs> uh, pear blossom and cucumber. A resplendent garden, flourishing with delicate pear blossom, rain-kissed jasmine, honeydew. And Meyer lemon smoothed by a splash of cucumber water. That's a lot to say. I like the smell of cucumber. I like that color. The color is nice too. Yeah, it's like a kind of like a teal or a greenish teal. It's, yeah, it's a mix between those. Hmm. Anything like that? That bright? I don't like. Green I don't smell like blossoms or anything like a floral. Now that I smell, I think that's pear. Blossoms. Hmm. I don't really smell the lemon too much. My dad's watching. Hi. Hello. How, I hope you're feeling better. We miss you. That smells good. Yeah. I like that. I don't know if it's Scentsy Club worthy. They're all Scentsy Club worthy, so you can keep them. Are you going to pay for that, Andy? 
Yeah, special guest. Tonight. Special guest Jeremy. Yes, All the way from he's doing an awesome job. Do you have to pay to put them in there? What? You have to pay to put them. In you have to buy place. them. Yes, you put yeah. them in your club and then you pay for them. Yes. So the more you add, the more your Cincy Club is. But mm -hmm. you know. But the more you add, but you're still you get ten percent off, and then you can but you're get still, that. You're I better still be buying hotter them. than a match. I'm be uh, Real quick. My poor brother came up here from Mississippi and ended up in the hospital. So we're hoping he gets out tomorrow. Crossing our fingers. If not, we'll come break you out. Yes. Because it's ridiculous what's happening. I won't go into details. Stay positive. Yes, stay positive. It could have been worse. All right. Coconut pumpkin pie. Ooh. That sounds good. That's a good mix. This is a long one. Fall's most delectable dessert enjoys an unexpectedly exotic touch as pumpkin puree, grated nutmeg, and maple sugar are heightened by a hint of coconut shavings. He says he's better out. He better be out tomorrow. I hope so. You better be out. I'll come out personally. Mm. What's that smell I just smelled? I smell pumpkin. And then I got a whiff of something else go. all of a sudden. It's probably pumpkin. All right. Definitely. <laughs> I'm your I'm your sensi lady. Yeah. Your best sister in the world. I can help you out with it too. That smells good. I, I smell the nutmeg on yeah. the bottom. That's that's good. I like that. Uh, that smells like Thanksgiving also. Yeah, it's one of them baking scents. Mm -hmm. Did you smell the bottom? I smelled nutmeg. Uh, Big uh, time on the bottom. You can have the baking scents. I like the citrusy and the fruity Andy, ones. Scentsy Club. No. <laughs> this is our last one? Yes. All right. Yeah, also I'm playing flower shopping. I saved the best yeah. for last. I have been Go waiting. Ahead. When I saw this, I know the CEO of Scentsy picked this one. This is one of his favorites, too. Sticky cinnamon bun. I love cinnamon rolls. I am a cinnamon roll junkie. Mm. I love them so much. Yeah, and many? I have been... You saved the best for last, Andy. How, how many cinnamon rolls have you eaten? <laughs> I always sit there and hope... Don't eat that one. I want it. Yeah. When you guys eat it, because I love cinnamon rolls. Like you want the perfect one. Yes. And I always have to have that middle one that doesn't crust. It's it's softer, the one that you put in the middle. Yeah. <sighs> Not what I was expecting. Uh-oh. I smell cinnamon. Definitely. But it doesn't have that... It's definitely cinnamon. It's a strong cinnamon, which I do love. Andy stole our packaging. That's definite st strong cinnamon. Yeah, we got to put these to the test. I love that. Yeah, so, them uh, you know, put them outside and see how they do. I know when I was in school, I used to have every Tuesdays at the Harrison Elementary mm -hmm. the warmed up honey buns. Okay. And this is what that smells like to me. Okay. Not overpowering, mm -hmm. but enough cinnamon there yeah. to know what it is. That's a maybe for me. Before the food sucks. Food's good there. They have good food. <laughs> I like that. That's crap. That's another bakery scent. Andy, will you stop or you're going to your room? Put that in the Scentsy Club. I got everything I think I I'll put that in there, too. I got everything I need. Okay, that's all of them. That is all of them. So what would you think? I like them. I know I'll be going back home yeah, to Mississippi with some Scentsy products. Every single one is in the Scentsy Club. He's not leaving without Scentsy products. Yeah, so here's his and I'm also loading I'm loading him up with samples to take down. Yeah. Because he works at the university down there. And uh, my dad will be responsible for passing those out. <laughs> 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 oh. 
as he commented. No. No, he hasn't well, commented. He must, he maybe he went to I, sleep. I don't I know. Said, yeah. All right. I hope you enjoyed. And he'll be going back in Mississippi soon. I might be back soon. Yes. We'll see. We miss you. Oh, there's Ethan. You can set up another location. And hopefully we get to see Uncle Ronnie tomorrow. We can have two shipping. Oh, locations. Ethan's going to sniff one. You like that? Then you set up a No business. comment. <laughs> All right. That was the Pima Cotton. Then you set up a, a business around the globe and you make millions mm -hmm. of dollars. My children, I swear. I don't know what I'm going to do with them. So I hope you all had a Merry Christmas. Well, there's nothing to Watch do. my posts. I definitely, I still have my January box. I know I just posted about it today. I got my New Year's grab bags. And you know, according to Dina, Dina agreed that I spoil you guys. So you will love it. So please let me know. Time is ticking. I need to know so I can get my products ordered. Anything from you, Jeremy? Nope. All right. Andy, anything from you? Nope. Um, <laughs> except every single bar is going into Sensor Club. He says every single bar is going into Sensor Club. All right. Woohoo! So you're going to have to pay for that. <laughs> no, Wait. Dad's going to have to pay for that. All right. Thank you. So, Thank you, Jeremy, for paying for it. So, everybody, have a good New Year's if I don't talk to you yeah, or see okay. you or anything. <laughs> And uh, I will talk to you later if my mouse will work. Bye-bye. <laughs>